She's worked on some of your favorite animated movies. And now she's on your favorite science show. She's really good at picking her projects. Let's meet animator Amy Lawson Smead. From the simple flipbook to the Victorian zoetrope to hand-drawn animation on celluloid sheets, artists have always used the latest technology to bring their imagination to life. These days, the primary tool for many artists is the computer. That's why today I'm meeting with character animator Amy Lawson Smead. I was always very interested in art. I loved painting. I loved drawing. And then it was in my, I think it was my third year of school, I took an animation course and I totally fell in love with just the idea of breathing life into these characters. I think even today, animation is such a lifelong journey. Every new scene that I animate, I'm still learning something new. With 20 years experience, Amy has helped bring some of your favorite movie characters to life. And today, she's showing me how she combines craft, creativity, and technology to create unforgettable animated performances. A foundational part of those performances happens in what's called the reference room, where the artists double as actors. This is where we get to pretend to be our characters. What you'll see is many mirrors on different walls. As I'm acting out a scene, I might need to see what it looks like from different angles. You'll see there's a camera over here. One of the first things that we're figuring out in as a character is just about how would they stand? So Nabil, if you were to be the king, how would you stand? Oh, very proper and very taut, I guess. That's very good. Versus if you were, say, like the king's brother, how would you maybe stand for that? Yeah, so there's <laughs> instantly, you can see a change in your body language. I'm not gonna be king. <laughs> what do I gotta be all postured up for? Exactly. Besides stances, animators like Amy capture different types of walks, movements, and especially facial expressions, like angst, awkwardness, laughter, love, disgust, and my specialty, triangle face. What I love about these is it's not only a facial expression, it's what our bodies are doing yeah. during. You can't not move your body. Yeah, anymore. exactly. Once the reference has been captured, Amy is ready to craft the performance, which is just one step towards a finished feature film. It starts off with our visual development artist that will design a character. They're doing tons of drawings on what Raya might look like. And then once that's bought off from the directors, it will go to our modeling team, the artists that are creating the sculpture that you see here. And then it will go to our riggers. They're building all of these controls for us. Gotcha. Then it comes to us in animation where we can start to build those performances. So This is a team sport. We do something called a rough blocking pass, which is just our main poses in the scene, and we show that first to the directors. Okay. Then we start going through and putting all of these other keys or in-betweens. If I let the computer give me my in-betweens, this is what's gonna happen. I kind of just assume that you set a point A and a point B, and then the computer will fill in all the gaps. But what you're telling me is that you have to fill every space in between point A and point B yes. manually. 24 frames per second throughout the whole scene. If I want to make her blink, I will select her two upper lid controls. There's no button that's just like blink? <laughs> no, we, we wish there was. There's hundreds of controls just in the face. And you can see all these red, those are all of my keys for just the lids. Just the lids? Yeah. The eyelids? Would you like to make her blink? I would love to make her blink. Now she's doing this. <laughs> that's right, she's winking at she's you. She's winking. Amy, thank you so much for showing me all this. You know, people tell me I'm a really animated guy, so I'd love to know, how'd I do today? You did fantastic. Yeah? I think you could have a job in animation. Okay, well, I'm gonna fill out a little job application all out right. front. Take care. <laughs> See ya. If you're watching this, you must have really liked the video. Make sure you follow and subscribe, and check out these other videos that are even better. No, really. I've seen this one over a hundred times. Thank you.